I'm Calvin of AJ Ministries. And this is a praying place. Um, if you're not familiar with what we do here, we allow the Lord in the first thing in a day. We give Him full control of our lives. We speak to Him before we speak to anyone else. We thank Him before we thank anyone else. We love on Him before we love on anybody else. Today we go forth in our prayers, loving people, loving God, and lifting Him up. I want to thank everybody that's been here before. I, I want to thank you for all your prayer requests. And I want to thank you for just doing the godly thing. Um, we give him thanks. For he is our healer. Father God, in the name of Jesus. Lord, I thank you today, God. Lord, I glorify your holy name. Lord, I lift you up on high. I give you all the praise and all the glory. For you're worthy of it, God. You're worthy of our love, our admiration, and and all the glory. Father, we thank you today for waking us up another morning, God. For letting the death angel pass by our houses once again, Lord. For giving us strength and the activity of our limbs, God. For touching our hearts, allowing it to beat nostrils to breathe, eyes to see, and freedom to glorify you, God. Lord, today I thank you. I thank you, God, for all you've done for us so far, God. Lord God, In the name of Jesus, we thank you for being our healer, our Jehovah Rapha. Lord, your word declares that you are our health, healing, and soundness in and over our lives. Father God, we have the healing of God. For by your stripes, we are healed. Lord, today we claim spiritual healing. We claim soulless healing. We claim physical healing. Lord, we also claim relational healing today. For we have been redeemed from the curse of the law according to Galatians. Lord, today we, we claim our healing from generational curses. Lord, we claim our healing of situational curses. Lord, we have been redeemed from sickness today. Lord, we're healed from poverty and spiritual death. We claim the health of God today. Lord, we have a soundness in our spirits. Lord, a soundness in our souls and in our bodies. 
Lord, we have a wholeness, a completeness we claim today, God. No more boundaries. No more fears, God. Healed from people, God. Healed from past hurts. Healed from the naysayers today, God. We are claiming our healing today in the name of Jesus. We present our bodies as living sacrifices, holy and acceptable to you, which is our reasonable service. We are not conformed to this world, but we have been transformed by the renewing of our minds according to your word. Lord, we know you are on our side we fear no man we are overcomers we are overcomers by the blood of the lamb we are set free Lord from all strongholds and bondages which cleans and tries to pull us down. We were set free by your righteousness and cleansed of all unrighteousness according to your word. Lord, we claim our health today. Our physical health first. Because of our bodies, any illnesses, any hurts, any pains, any isms or schisms that may be going on in our bodies, we rebuke it in the name of Jesus. We claim it today, God. We are healed. Not we may be healed, not we might be healed, but we are healed, God. And we walk in that healing today. In the name of Jesus. God, today, we claim spiritual healing today, God. We renounce right now in the name of Jesus anything that was hindering us from getting closer to you, from growing closer to you, from getting closer to you, God. Lord, male, female, we bind it up right now. Friend or foe, we put them behind us right now, God, so that we may open our eyes to see you and come closer to you, Lord God, for your spiritual healing, Lord, for your spiritual peace, love, and understanding, God. We need to be made whole today in the name of Jesus. We need to be made whole from past hurts. We need to be made whole from stress, bill collectors, and emotional damages. Lord, we need to be made whole. Lord, we made whole because of the word which is hidden in our hearts to keep us from returning to those strongholds according to Psalms. And we love not our life unto death, but we lay it down every day and pick up our cross. That we may follow you and be of good health in all our days. Lord, your goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives. 
In you we trust. In you we praise and have our being, God. God, we won't do it any longer on our own merits. We won't try it any longer on our own strengths. We won't move unless we move in you, God. Lord, I thank you today. I thank you for complete healing. Lord, I ask you right now to lay your hands on our marriages today. On our relationships. Lord, touch them right now in a miraculous way. Lord, we ask you right now to heal us. To put back together our marriages. To strengthen them. The bonds that kept us and that will continue to keep us. But we also ask you, God, if, if it is our time for those relationships to be broken apart, Lord God, pull those relationships apart to immediately be set free to glorify you, God. Lord of our stress is coming from an internal place, Lord God. Heal our minds. Heal our minds today. Heal our minds, God. Lord, take away those things that confuse us. That distract us. That hinder us. From doing. The work of the Lord. Lord you said. That you could give us the peace. That passes all understanding. Lord the peace. That only you can bring the peace. Of joy and love. That we shall enter into our souls. No longer Lord will we fear the flesh and blood of men. For your words tell us. Fear not who can kill the body. But fear he who can kill the soul. Lord, we know that all things work together for our good, God. That the things that we're going through right now are only going through them to make us stronger for our tomorrows and our tomorrows. Lord, today, we claim our healing in you. We claim our healing through you. We claim our healing with you, God. For not by our own might, but through your might, God. For we can do all things through you who strengthens us. Lord, now we ask you, God, to cover our children. Lord, put a hedge of protection about them. Keep them as they go forth into their normal days, God. Lord, as they walk this walk, God, not understanding that it's you who's walking with them. It's you who is keeping them. It's you who is covering them, God. Lord, we may not be in the best place, God, but we're in a better place than we was yesterday. Lord, they may not be in the best place you want them to be, Lord God, but keep them. Keep your hands on them. Keep them wrapped in your arms, God. 
till they come around. Lord, your word tells us that some plants, some water, but you give the increase. Lord, your word tells us to come as we are. Lord, you taught us that we, you came for the lost, God. Before our lost children, we pray right now, go back and get them. Lord, with all our talking, with all our prayers, God, we need you to change their hearts. Lord, we know that we don't save people, that you save people. We know that we don't protect people, that you protect people. And it's by your saving grace we're here today. We're asking you today for mercy. We're asking you for good health. Help them, God. Give them the health of spirit, God. Lord, we bind up that, that demon of lust that comes to steal, kill, and destroy. We bind up that demon of greed where all they want to do is grab for more and more. Let them understand, God. Stop reaching for the gift. But reach for the giver. God, this day, we claim total healing in our families. That we'll come back together. That it'll be like days of old. Grandmama, auntie, and unk. Sitting together, breaking bread. That we'll start to talk to one another more. That we'll understand one another better. That we'll greet one another with the glory of God. That we'll start to understand that agape love. That we'll share it amongst our children so they'll grow. As we did. Today God. We claim our healing. Lord cover our feet. For the preparation. Of the gospel. Lord your. Sandals. Of peace will enable us to walk in the spirit so we can confront any evil put us on the breastplate your helmet your shield and your sword that we may fight this battle God like never before that we may fight this battle unto thee. In the name of Jesus, we claim our healing today, God. We take back our streets. Because, Lord, you can heal the land. We take back our schools. Our neighborhoods and our cities, God. In the name of Jesus, we thank you today, God. We glorify you and we lift on high. For you are the Alpha and the Omega. You are Jehovah Jireh. You are Jehovah Rapha.
our healer. In Jesus' name we pray. Today, if there's any under the sound of my voice that may be in a backslidden state, know that you're not too far gone for God. If there's any that just happen to stop by this prayer room and want to give their lives to God, this is the time. This is the time for you to say, Lord, you have come into my life. You are my Savior. I humble myself unto thee. By your stripes I am healed. You have lifted me up and you gave your life for me. With these words, I follow. If you repeated that, you are saved. If you believe in your heart, you are redeemed. If you follow his word, you shall be set free. God is a reward of those who diligently seek Him. God doesn't hold your past against you. God can give you life and give it more abundantly. You have to know we come before Him First, because he pulled us out of the miry clay, he gave us another chance when we didn't deserve it. Grace is unmerited favor, mercy we didn't deserve, and love undiluted in any way today I thank you that all came that found it not robbery to stand before the Lord in prayer and love on him as never before I hope to see you again I hope to see you on one of my live broadcasts where we take turns and Pray our prayers to God. When we come together as a group in unification on our live streams. I love you. I thank you. And with Him, we bless you. In Jesus' name. You have a great day.